Pete, there's been a pretty big break between the, the second and third test. How have the guys gone about uh, focusing on the rest of the series? Uh, well, it was good to actually have a, have a couple of days off. Um, personally, I went away with the family and, and checked out uh, Agra and Jaipur and, and did the touristy uh, side of things for India, which was, which was very nice and I hadn't done a lot of uh, before this. And I think the other boys got away from, from the game by playing a bit of golf and, and having a bit of downtime that way. So, nice little uh, refresher break um, to, to give us the, the energy and the drive to, to push hard for these last two tests. And how important is that World Test Championship final and just securing your place in that? Yeah, it's obviously very important. Um, you know, these last two tests, uh, there's still a lot riding on it. One for uh, trying to draw a test series over here in India, which is a, a pretty big thing to, to be able to do as well. Uh, but also to secure our spot in the, in the test championship final, um, which would be, you know, amazing to be a part of. And I guess to do it without um, you know, two of your pretty senior guys in Pat and, and Dave, um, how, much, how much more difficult is that going to be? Yeah, obviously, like two world-class uh, world players. So. Um, and, and our captain as well, so it's, it's definitely going to make it tougher. Um, but you know we've got all the information we need, we've got uh, the training um, that we need and the facilities that we need to, to be ready to go for, for indoor and, and, and at a bad. So um, yeah, it's going to be a big loss uh, not having those two, uh, but also you know Mitch Stark is, is coming back from injury. Uh, Green is coming back from injury. We've got a couple of big ins potentially as, as well. So, um, you know, there's a, that exciting part as well. And obviously, <coughs> sorry, uh, Steve taking over as captain. I mean, you played a lot under him during your first iteration as, as a test cricketer. What, um, have you, you know, kind of coming back into the team now, what have you noticed in, in terms of Steve? Different person, um, same person, same batter. What, what have you noticed? Ah, uh, same batter. Yeah. <laughs> um, no, he's very similar. I don't think he, he um, yeah, he hasn't changed too much. It's, it shows he's a world-class player um, and thinks about the game a lot. So, uh, you know, he's a good one to have under under Paddy. Um, he's obviously experienced in this uh, in this situation as well. So, uh, it was not something new for him. So he can he can just go about his business. Um, the way he normally does, and you know he'll be focusing on his batting first and, and sort of the captaincy second. I think maybe some more senior heads in, in terms of you know you're, you're coming back. I know you're not necessarily a senior head, but you have captain your state. You've got two other state captains. Is that a bit of a different, um, uh, a bit of a different vibe to, to 2017 and, and that first first time you're in the team? Oh, definitely a different vibe for myself um, coming back to India. It, yeah, sort of know know what to expect now, and, and having having been here, um, you sort of get a feel for it and how, how the game works and how the how the vibe is. Um, but yeah, definitely having a, having yeah those those senior heads around, other state captains, um, you know that'll that'll give Smudge or someone uh, a few people to, to lean on if um, you know he feels like he needs it. Should we indoor or pretty much not we getting it? It's it's a wait and see. Um, Every every stadium every stadium is different, and uh, indoor wicket could be could be anything. So it's it's hard to go into a game or, or go into a place with preconceived ideas of, of what the wicket's going to be, um, because you don't want to be playing the game um, in your head before you've even turned up. So we'll, we'll wait and see what the wicket is, um, and then uh, and then we'll figure out what we're doing then. How did you guys sort of feel in the training two tests? Uh, it's been good the two training days here. Uh, you know we had the facilities to be able to just keep working on those game plans that we've we've been working on for you know two three four weeks now, um, trying to make sure that yeah we're nice and clear and calm when we when we get out there and um, you know we're very lucky that we had a lot of net bowlers coming down as well to, to facilitate our, our net sessions. So batters have, have got everything they've needed. The the bowlers have been able to bowl all day if they wanted to as well. So. Um, yeah, we're, we're definitely ready to go for this next test, uh, albeit with two more training sessions in indoor. And just one. It's not easy, so that's, um, yeah, it's pretty, pretty understandable that, that Pat's gone home and um, it, it's always going to be family first. Yeah, that's, a, that's a good mentality around this group, so um, yeah, there's a lot of empathy going towards Pat and, and the boys have been sending, sending messages and, and wishing um, yeah, him and his family you know, lots of love and, and support. It was pretty incredible what he was able to do in the, the first two tests and just be across here knowing 
what was going on at home just yeah, yeah. It's such a difficult situation yeah absolutely to be able to sort of put that to one side while he's out um captaining his country and trying to win two test matches uh, is a pretty incredible effort so I think that speaks volumes about his character and and why he's been such a um, incredible captain for us uh, so far so yeah what he's what he's doing is pretty, pretty special but um, yeah it, it, it's good that he's home with his family and, and, and having that time. Has that been something just more you know, giving a player time if, if they need it in a family sense? Yeah I think that's just generally being <laughs> good people yeah. um, in any in any workforce or any business around the world I think family is still number one so um, yeah if anything's ever going on then you got to be able to uh, to go home and look after your family your job's always going to be there cricket's always going to be there so um, yeah I think if there's if there's any any time you need to go home for any reason then it's um, it's, it's a good thing that we can facilitate that I'm good.